Hey guys, it's Rachel from the Little Rain Lamb. Today's a new top five Wednesday day. Today's topic is top five books you want to reread. The Goodreads page for the top five Wednesday group will be linked in the down bar, so you guys should go check out other people's videos or you guys can join in on the fun if you want. So basically, I have so many books I want to reread. Like almost every book I read, and it's been like a year, so I just feel a compulsion to go back to, to see what I loved about that book. Because if you've been watching my book or using my channel, I do read a lot of books. I see the majority of my reviews, I rate books a lot of the time for their plot 4 out of 5. I don't know, like am I just easily impressed with books? Who knows? But a lot of them I just really love and I want to get back to them. So starting with number 5 is The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants by Amber Shares. Now this series I don't think I've read in a while. The first time I read it I was in grade 7 and I believe I read it once over in high school again. I believe it was grade 10. And I haven't read it since then so I really want to just get to this series. Um, this would be a series that I want to pick up like next May when I'm off of school and yeah this is just the movie cover edition because I got this one. Um, I This was in the original edition I read but yeah I just really love this series and I just really want to go back to revisit it because I feel like it's not talked about as much anymore because you know books come and go uh, but this one is definitely like a good one and I really need to watch the movie like I think the disc, one of my discs is broken because I have like one of those, like it's a double side disc so one's like the first movie and one's the second movie and I think it's broken so I really want to reread this so then I can watch the movies again and then check that out. Um, but you know, I saw the first movie, not as good as the book but it's still pretty good and I like the actresses in it because they're in a lot of my other favorite shows. Number four is The Carrie Diaries by Candace Bushnell. I'm not sure if this is a duology or supposed to be a series. There's no other books after the second one, so I assume it's a duology, but I haven't really got confirmation on that. But I really enjoyed this series. I think I read this duology when I was in grade nine, so it's been about eight years since I've read this. And I really enjoyed it. I just really want to go back and read it. Um, I watched the Carrie Diaries TV show. I didn't get to see, I don't think, the second season because they stopped airing it either. I think they stopped airing it on the channel I was watching it on and I used to catch up with it on the app or something like that it just it was a weird airing schedule maybe or something uh, but I didn't get to keep up with it and I really just want to reread the books so I really did enjoy them. Um, number three is Silver Girl by Ellen Hildebrand. I haven't read this one in a long time either. Uh, I really love Ellen Hildebrand's books and I just really want to do a reread of this one because this one was really interesting. I think I read this one in like three days which is pretty big to read in three days and I was just addicted to these books. I love like that's one of my favorite things about summer Ellen Hildebrand's new release like even if I don't get to the new release sometimes I'm like a year behind so I'll read the one that came out last year but it's one of my favorite things of summer and I just love her books so much so I really want to go back and reread some of them starting with this one. Number two is I've Got Your Number by Sophie Kinsella. I really want to reread this one. <laughs> I keep saying that whole sentence but obviously you guys know I want to reread all these but I reread this the first time and I really want to reread it. I think I reread that I mean read this for the first time like three years ago and it was so good and every year I put on my reread list so I really hope to get to it soon but like there's so many books and then I want to go back. I really feel like sometimes in the month like when I'm not in school like summertime I should maybe allow like two books on my TBR to like reread and then maybe one in the spring semester one in the fall semester so I can get through some of these rereads. Maybe I should start implementing that. And number one is kind of an odd choice because I just read this book this like summer and it's The Truth About the Harry Kubert Affair by Jewel Dicker. This book, like it's tied with the Sarah Shepard book, The Amateurs, for being my favorite book of the year. This is my favorite unexpected book of the year. Um, I've read, I think, 66 books this year. This is so good. And like it, it, it got translated to English and it was like a French literary prize, but I don't hear enough people talking about this and it's amazing. And it's just the writing's beautiful, the mystery is really interesting. Ah, uh, yeah. Can't say enough good things about that. And I just really want to reread it because I'm still raving over it and nobody in my life has still read it. So, like, if. <sighs> Somebody please, let's just discuss. Um, I think I discussed with a few people. But, like, I really want my best friend to read it because I feel like typing over the internet, like, just does not get my emotions out. Like, I just need to scream and, like, really project my voice. Um, yeah, that's just me though. Um, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Definitely let me know what books you guys want to reread and if any of these ones in particular. And yeah, I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.